Hello guys and welcome to a brand new food review. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. Now I've been to Iceland and let's have a look at what I've got. So here guys we've got the fully loaded mac and cheese burger pasta for just £2.50 from Iceland. And look at that. Layered with mini beef burgers, gherkins and mozzarella in a cheese and mustard sauce. Now I'm going to get this one in the oven but let's have a look of what we've really got. Hello guys and welcome back to the video. Thanks a lot for watching this one. Fully loaded mac and cheeseburger pasta. That's what we have today. It's from Iceland for £2.50. Sort of similar to the uh, all day breakfast one I got literally yesterday. So it was like two for five pounds. Looking at this here looks actually pretty decent. You've got little mini burgers on top there which were pretty cool actually. We've got some gherkins. So let's see how this one tastes. It's actually 10 o'clock in the morning. Uh, so I don't mind eating early in the morning. It doesn't really matter what it is. I just sort of eat it. So uh, let's give this a whirl. Mm. You got a really nice cheeseburger sauce. And those burgers on top actually, they they got like a cardboard consistency, which is a little bit weird. Let's go. Mmm. I really like that. Uh, it tastes exactly like a cheeseburger, as you would expect, but obviously sometimes that's not always the case. It's quite a lot of food here, which is pretty good. A little bit similar to yesterday's all-day breakfast, but it is, yeah, just... It's weird, but it is pretty good. Oh. Cooking instructions really are 40 minutes in the oven, uh, 30 minutes, and then you take off the plastic seal. And then literally, last 10 minutes to brown it off, I guess, and then bang. There's a bit of burger with the sauce on it. It tastes right, it tastes like burgers, so you can't complain. Pasta's really nice. Got some gherkins in there, which had a different element. Obviously, if you don't like gherkins, take them out. Mmm. £2.50, it's not actually that bad at all. My cold is still here, still lingering around. But I think I'll probably be able to shake it off by tomorrow. And then tomorrow, obviously, it's game day, so I'll be at the festival. Uh, I call it a festival, but it's pretty much like 10 till 10, 10 in the morning till 10 at night sort of thing. I really like this. I think it's actually really good from Iceland. There's a lot of stuff like this there in Iceland now. They've brought out like a whole range of it. So literally just fill your boots. Mmm. I mean, it does taste really nice. It does taste really good. If I could give it a rating of out of 10. Probably like a 7. I mean, it wasn't as good as the all day breakfast because I love all day breakfasts. And this is nice, it is good, it is very good, but it's nothing outstanding. It is what it says on the packaging, really. That's all you can ask for, but... It's like a very doomy, grey, rainy, funery outside, which is very common here in Cornwall. Fuck I mean, yeah, it's alright. It does taste good. But yeah, not as good as the all breakfast. That's going to be it, guys, for this review. Thank you very much for watching. I'll make sure there's a few videos for you guys over the weekend. Um, have a great weekend, guys. Subscribe if you're new. And most of all, thank you for the support so far. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Peace.